Just wanted to hop on here real quick and show you some products that uh, HIPAA sent me. They sent me some earmuffs. These are noise canceling earmuffs, 25 uh, decibel rating earmuffs. I want to tell you my personal thoughts on these headphones after I give you the product specification. Uh, and I want to tell you if you should buy these headphones and if you should not. There's some things that I disagree with on their product specifications, um, and there's some things that I agree with. So let's get into the product specifications that are directly on HIPAA's website. Ergonomic headband with soft padding reduces the pressure on your head for superior comfort and generous space inside the ear cups to ensure breathability. Meanwhile, soft imitation leather provides a tight soundproof seal constructed by solid ABS shell and thicken noise dampening foam. The earmuffs offer a NRR 25 decibel rating and block out noise by a great amount. Pull and push the earmuffs from the metal string to adjust the size Compact folding design for easy storage and convenient portability. The noise canceling headphones fold up nicely to fit in a range bag, backpack, or briefcase while taking only a small space. Stylish hearing protectors are ideal for shooting, hunting, sporting events, studying, woodworking projects, and lawn care. They are extremely suitable for operating heavy machinery or a landscaping business. So now let's talk about these headphones and the product specifications on HIPAA's website. Uh, I'm, pardon me, I'm reading some of my notes because I can't remember everything that I just said. <laughs> Sometimes that's how it goes, right? Um, so noise canceling headphones, 25 decibel rating. You put these on. And yes, it blocks out quite a bit of um, noise. I would say 25 decibel rating is probably fairly accurate. Um, I have 25 decibel rating headphones um, in my garage when I sharpen blades and stuff. Um, I would say that these headphones block out very close to the same amount of noise as those headphones. So the 25 decibel rating I would agree with. Now HIPAA does say that this is an ergonomic design. Yes, these are the lightest headphones I've ever held in my hand. Um, very soft padding in here. You guys can see it does a 360 right around. This is very soft padding right in here. It does provide a lot of space right in here for your ear. So if you have huge, ginormous, giant ears, they are going to fit in these headphones. Uh, that being said, even with the huge ear holes here and the very soft padding, you put these on your head, it's extremely tight and it's not very comfortable. So personally, um, where would I use these headphones? I would not be afraid to use these headphones sharpening blades, mower blades in the garage. You're going to wear these for 10, 20, half an hour. Um, but I would not want these on my head for more than an hour. Just having them on my head right here, it's kind of quiet. And maybe I'm talking a little bit louder, but I can feel it right in here causing a whole lot of pressure. Um, and in my jawline right here, I can feel a whole lot of stress um, and wearing these headphones for a long period of time is not going to be ideal, um, especially if you're going to, if you want a pair of headphones um, for daily use, these are probably not what you want. HIPAA's product specifications, it says that the outer shell is ABS material um, and believe it or not, back in the day I used to work at Menards a long, long time ago in the plumbing department and I know what ABS is. ABS is just a fancy word for plastic. It's just a plastic material on the outside. It's definitely, it, you can bang it here and it sounds hollow. Uh, it definitely is a plastic material uh, that is very, very lightweight. So if you are looking for something that is lightweight, this may be uh, the way to go for you. So say that these headphones do have a ergonomic design. Um, I wouldn't say that they're any more ergonomic than any other headphone um, that I have ever owned. Yes, these do flip. Um, do a 360 here. You can push. Let's see if I can push these. You can't even push them all the way in because then it comes out on the other side here. It looks like um, but they do flip 360 like that. You can store them like this. I don't even know, guys. Really not that ergonomic, more ergonomically um, designed than any other headphone that I have. So I don't know. Ergonomics, I guess you can decide. 
So it was also stated in their specifications that these headphones are uh, stylish. I would say that they're not bad. Um, it just feels cheaply made. I mean, granted, you're only spending $17 for these headphones. So if you're looking for a cheap headphone, that's what you're going to get. You're going to get a cheap headphone. Um, like I said, if you're sharpening blades, only using these for 20 minutes at a time, um, this is definitely a good option to, to go with because you're not spending a whole bunch of money on a headphone um, that you're only going to be using 20 minutes at a time. So if that... Anything I would say more than 20 minutes at a time, I would recommend going with a different headphone. Um, who would I recommend these headphones for? Um, they are, like I said, they are really tight on my ears. My wife, I had my wife put these on uh, just to make sure it wasn't me. She said pretty much the same things that I said. Cheap headphone, um, they block out noise, hurt your ear and jawline, uh, not very comfortable. That being said, if you're taking your kids to a, I don't know, motocross show, somewhere, sporting event that's going to be extremely loud, um, yes, I would actually buy these headphones to save some money. Uh, they're kids, right? They're, their face and jawline are going to be smaller. This is probably going to be more beneficial for a kid or young adult um, that has a thinner face. Um, and you know what? My face, I feel like, is not <laughs> the biggest face. I do have a huge beard here, but um, still, man, I tell you what, right in the jawline, it just is not comfortable. Let me read my paper. They said, this is ideal for hunting, which, yeah, I mean, if you're going to be shooting guns, this is probably not a bad headphone to have. It's going to block out the gun. Um, if you're hunting and just want to throw it on real quick to block out the noise of one or a couple shots, I would go with this instead of a more expensive headphone. Um, they said studying. I would, I don't think you're going to be want, wanting to study for school or anything with these headphones on. Um, that would just kind of be silly if you were in the library wearing the HIPAA headphones. Um, people would be looking at you like, <laughs> you're an idiot or something like that so studying i don't know if i buy that one that's kind of a stretch woodworking i could see definitely woodworking uh wearing these headphones for woodworking um 20 minutes to a half an hour at a time just throw them on take them off real quick um throw them on the counter pick them up i mean it is cheap uh but this abs material is um, in my experience, pretty durable. So if you're throwing them on the counter and putting them back on your heads, um, you're probably going to get a couple scratches here and there, but, uh, I, unless you're being stupid with it, I don't see, uh, these breaking. They also say extremely suitable for heavy equipment. Now, yes, that may be so. Uh, but if I was digging a grave or on an excavator or in, um, a bobcat i don't think i would again i wouldn't want these on for more than 20 minutes at a time and if you're doing any landscaping and excavating work like that you guys are usually in that machine for more than 20 minutes at a time they also claim for lawn care yeah i mean if you're doing your house residential house don't be afraid to grab these headphones um less than an hour half an hour these headphones will be just fine. I really do want to give a huge shout out to HIPAA for sending me this product. I'm really grateful for them and supporting the channel. Um, so it's obviously not going to be the best made headphones that you've ever had. It's definitely not the best made headphones that I've ever had. It's not the worst headphones that I've ever had. I have had one pair of headphones that um, just hurt my ears quite a bit more than this, and it's just not as comfortable as these. Uh, that being said, you are only paying 17 I think, 88 for these headphones. I will leave a link in the description below to my uh, Amazon affiliate link. Um, and if you click that link, you are helping out the lawn care channel and keeping me motivated to make these videos and that's why i am continuing to make these videos so if you guys have stuck with this entire video this long um consider checking these hipaa headphones out um weigh, outweigh the pros and outweigh the cons if you're having these on your head for more than a half an hour i would recommend not getting them if you're looking for a cheap headphone for your kids um a cheap headphone that you're only going to be wearing a half an hour at most, uh, I would recommend these headphones. If you're going to be um, wearing these headphones for more than a half an hour and you're an adult, 
I would not recommend these headphones just because they do hurt your jawline. So I do want to give a huge shout out to HIPAA. Um, even though that is a cheap headphone, that's, I mean, that's what you're paying for that you, you just know you're going to get a cheap headphone that does black out um, a good amount of noise. Uh, so if you're not looking to spend that much money, I would consider these headphones. They've also sent me, HIPAA has also sent me these gloves, HIPAA fixed machines can be easier hippastore.com they sent me these extra large gloves here i'll try one on real quick i actually wore these today um so i believe they are um knife resistant so if you're cutting with something with a knife or something like that um it's not going to cut through these gloves i would say these gloves would be perfect for gardening or pulling weeds something of that nature just like that. They are pretty stylish and I am actually, these are one of the products um, that I am most impressed with HIPAA that they've sent me. These gloves are very nice. These gloves guys, they are pretty stylish. I really do like these gloves. Um, if you are interested in a pair of these gloves, HIPAA said that you guys on my YouTube channel can get a pair of these gloves for free. So in the comments below type HIPAA gloves and I will uh, shoot you my email address and yeah, we'll get, I'll tell you how to get a pair of these gloves for free, sent right out to you just because they support the Lawn Care channel and support you guys for watching the Lawn Care channel. Uh, really appreciate them for doing that. Um, yeah, these are really nice gloves. Snow is kind of melting a little bit, so I'm going to have a little bit of time off for plowing. Finally, get some time to clean the trailer, clean the truck, clean the garage. Um, just bought some um, new lights that I'm going to put in my garage to... So I can see a little bit better in my garage. I found them on uh, my buddy's YouTube channel, uh, Young Blood Family Farm. So if you're interested in how a family farm works, um, go check out Young Blood Family Farms. And I probably will be doing a review video on those lights that he uh, reviewed and showed how to install in his video. So pretty excited about that. Can't wait to get those and uh, put those in my garage so I can finally clean my garage. Possibly even going to put them in my uh, enclosed trailer to uh, be able to see better uh, when it's dark outside. So last thing, guys, if you do want a pair of these headphones um, to win for free, HIPAA said one of my subscribers can have a pair of these headphones for free. So let's comment gloves, HIPAA gloves in the comments. If you want to win these headphones, comment headphones, HIPAA headphones. Um, and one person, I will randomly choose one person to win these headphones. Win these headphones, I will email you how to pick up your free pair of headphones directly from HIPAA's website. Appreciate you supporting the Lawn Care channel. And it is kind of cool to have free stuff to give away for you guys, uh, the subscribers, because this is really all for you guys. So, um, yeah, I'm going to get back out there and probably go inside and take a break today and uh, just spend some time with the family. So God bless. Take care. Michael Douglas, Douglas Lawn Care, signing off. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.